What is up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to make some really cool ambient um, abstract pads uh, like some of the ones I made in my super pack uh, which sound like these So the first thing I'm going to do is open up some kind of plug-in. Uh, I'm thinking maybe a piano. Uh, let's turn reverb off. And let's create some random type of pattern. Uh, let's make it a little more weird. Line. Let's do something like this. Okay, so we just have this. Super simple. Uh, so now I'm just put you there so I'm recording this in. So let's go into Edison. And let's just sample that. There we go. And let's trim it. And then let's open up a fruity granulizer. Just throw this in there. So now we have this. Pretty bland, pretty boring. So let's loop it throw it on random and you get this really really fast so if you want to slow it down turn the hold up it's kind of choppy so let's clean it up with spacing maybe add a pan effect Let's send it into a mixer. Do a little bit of mixing here to uh, take out the low end. Maybe I clean it up a little bit. And then let's add some delay. Uh, let's try delay two. Ping pong. There we go. Uh, then let's add some. Well, let's actually set, add some like kind of multi band compression, be sound -gadizer. Yeah. And then let's add some reverb. And see what happens. Like it is really lush ambient sounds. Like that one sounds really cool, so what I gotta do is just go into your Edison again. And I have a sustain pedal for my piano that I could just press and let it just go on forever. So let's just record that. And boom, now you have a pad that you could make. 
So thanks guys for watching and I'll have the link in the description for my super pack and for a Patreon if you guys want to check that out. So yep, yeah, see you guys later.